inches wide and capable of storing a whopping 80 kilobytes. <laughs> Stolen by our friends at the CIA, the disk held the launch codes to Soviet nukes. Uh, this is not the disk, of course, but one exactly like it, a perfect fusion of concepts vibrating in the Cold War era collective unconscious. A receptacle. It is a receptacle for dangerous energies to hone in on, and they did. We don't have the details, but when things started flying around the disk, it was transferred to us. It's an object of power. Oh, okay. Oops. Oh, and it can launch things telekinetically through the air. Uh, to date, we've, we've launched maybe three dozen pencils. And once, we even launched a cup. Riveting technology, guys. Like, that's never been seen before. Launching things like cups. Wow. Unbelievable work they're doing here at the, uh, the Federal Bureau of Control. Insanity. Cannot believe it. Clearly, they were ahead of its time. Patients are on the right track. Okay, before that, uh, let me explore a little bit down here. To whom it may concern, I am being contacted by the past presidents of the United States of America. They appear as spirit guides, giving me their wisdom. John Adams keeps saying, I need to fix America, but I can't really understand him. They all have a lot of opinions. People tell me I'm imagining it, but Theodore Roosevelt showed me how to fix my lawnmower. And I don't know a thing about lawnmower. It's explain that. Yeah, take that. Um, I have great dead man telling me about the past and the present. If you like to use my abilities to help prop the government, please let me know. I know the White House could use me. Yours in earnest, James Bartholomew. I think this is one of the letters that they were talking about of how like uh, stupid it was. Hello, avid readers. The Bureau Book Bunch. The BBB? Okay. We'll convene at the usual spot corner of the table cafeteria at 5 p.m. on Tuesday. Currently discussing Unless You by J.D. Brooks. Everyone should get their reviews to me by Monday before lunch so I can generate some conversation starters before the meeting. Happy reading. Great. Book nerds. What the actual fuck did I just watch? <laughs> what? <laughs> Dude, what the fuck is that? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, dude, whatever. Alright. Uh, communications letter. Jesus Christ, what a creepy fucking show. Welcome to the comms department. We are here to help. Who's this guy? Oh, yeah, I never I haven't been here.
Uh, these guys just float. They do know they're like several tens of feet away from the ground, right? Lady, you okay? The fuck? Ow! What the fuck? Okay, so it's the hiss. You good, guy? of power. Looks like the hiss have latched onto it. We need to cleanse it. Object of power, where is it? Fuck me. Okay, I might want to consider running. Run! What are you doing? Run, lady. Fuck. I don't think you can reach up here. We're good. We're good. So how am I supposed to... Shit, I forgot. Oh, it's the... Oh, that's what it does. So it gives me the power of telekinesis. Okay. It's harder to hear you when I'm here. It's like the channel's been changed. The boards in charge here. They're pyramids in a bureau seal. Are they really the ones pulling the strings? I'm not their director. I'm no one's director.
Did he fall? Dead. Dead. Oh, fuck. Got it. Just like you wanted, right? This will help me whole game gives me anxiety, dude, I swear. Demolitions expert. His corrupted ranger formidable. Prior to corruption, his rangers utilized these weapons as well as the advanced tactics taught by the Bureau's instructors. Some are additionally outfitted with Bureau-made body armor. His rangers are, have no observed paranatural abilities beyond some protected shielding of the densest resonance capable of stopping bullets. Ah, that's that's cool. That's great. So they pretty much are OP by all definition. Must be contained in a cell with no other loose material. The object is an 8-inch disc. This cat like containing Soviet area nuclear launch codes when bound to the object allows peritilitarians to tele telekinetically lift material and throw it a short distance. The object is currently bound to redacted for research purposes, stolen from a Soviet military base in. Hmm. Interesting. So these are kind of like. Ah, shit. These are all like um, SCPs. In a way, it's like a weird SCP thing. Automatically makes this hell of a lot more cooler, too. I really, I really don't like the person talking right now. Huh? Why are they all talking, man? I have a feeling there's gonna be another enemy here. Okay, so you can fast route from here. Okay, bunch of noises. Great. 
Somewhere along the line, things went weird. No one was sure whether it was something caused by someone or something, or if it was just happened by itself. There were a lot of stories. Everyone had a theory of how it happened, of which the weirdest and only fittingly singled out were supposed to talk about a strange golden space helmet that someone had found in a secret research project. Huh? Who wrote this report to Dr. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. I do not like this spot. Not at all whatsoever. The janitor. <laughs> 